chilly. Not as warm. Highs 82 to 88, except 76 to 86 near the bay. Okay, so let's talk about how your policies are structured. Sections. A, dwelling. Obviously, all the sticks and stones and everything that's attached to the house. B, other structures, things that are not attached. Gate, uh, decks that are not attached, detached garage, well shed, storage sheds. Section C, personal property, also known as content. Stuff that's not bolted down, like this board or my lamp or my couch. Loss of use, in case I got to move out and I got to rent a place, take care of a place, take care of myself in the manner in which I'm accustomed. Liability, in case somebody sues me. And medical payments, in case somebody hurts himself, but there's no lawsuit. I just want to fix his broken hand or whatever happened in my place. A, B, C, D, E, F. Okay, these are the limits you'll see on your policy. 584 covers the dwelling. Uh, you know, if the house is worth 584 or whatever it is, sure, we'll buy that. 59,000 and other structures, that can vary. Usually it's percentage. You can tweak that. You know, some people say, hey, I don't have any other structures. I don't want to pay for this coverage. Or I want to reduce it way down. Or maybe I have a very, very expensive uh, another unit outside or what have you. Personal property contents. Now look at this one. This is where we normally see things that are a little strange. This guy's house is worth 584, but he's got his contents worth 438. Are you kidding me? What does he have? Gold furniture? Remember, there are limits on cash and jewelry and other things. And if you got a Picasso, you just can't say you had it. You got to get it appraised. We have to schedule it uh, on a separate schedule. So we see uh, this a lot where the contents are boosted way up. Don't know if that's because uh, previously somebody wanted to get the premiums up. I don't know. But normally you give me $5,000 per room and twenty grand for the kitchen. I'm good to go. I'll probably be happy to buy brand new Thomasville stuff everywhere. So <clears throat> in my case, this is way, 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 way too high. Most people sometimes, uh, sometimes they'll come in and say, I don't have anything I want to insure on the inside. But normally we'll put something there. But this is, in my opinion, way too high. Uh, loss of use in case I got to move out and uh, uh, live to the manner I'm accustomed. You know, you can tweak that one. Liability in case somebody sues me. Uh, definitely 500 in my opinion. Plus an umbrella over top of that. So if I get sued for, for more than 500 grand, I'm covered up to a mil or two, or two mil. Those umbrella policies are not very expensive, a couple hundred bucks a year or what have you. And then medical payments, no lawsuit, guy just broke his finger and I want to pay for it, okay? So the things that we can do to tweak this also, deductible, 10K is, you know, high deductible. Some people want that because it'll get the premium down. So there's certain things we can do to get these things down, okay? Generally, you are going to be covered by CalFair and another smaller policy. CalFair will cover these things. For uh, fire and smoke, there's some other things you can add, and we'll go over that in another video. But that's how it's structured. This is what we look at. I look at especially this one and the deductible and some of the other things that you can add or not add. Don't worry. You can get a policy, probably two, CalFair and a smaller other one. But without CalFair, stop giving them such a bad name. Without them, you couldn't get insured. And they are regulated by the Department of Insurance. And it's just all the other insurers that are canceled you anyway. They're all forced to go into CalFair and whatever percentage they cover in the California market. That's the, the part of CalFair that they have to cover as well. CalFair also has to be requoted every year. So you'll get a policy. My license number and contact information is at the end of this video. And there are lots of fine agents around the county. My name is Mark Cunaberti. Thanks for watching. We'll be back.